everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Wynn and today I'm gonna film a what I eat in a day. As someone who's trying to stay active and fit, there are some things I do want to improve on, which are my shoulders and my back. I want to eat close to my maintenance level, which is probably around 17, 1800 calories per day, but I don't see any muscular improvements. I might bump it up to 2000 per day. So right now I'm just kind of playing around with my caloric intake because for a long time I was like only eating 12 or 1300 calories per day, which is not enough for my body to grow anything. The reason why I was in such a low caloric deficit was because I wanted to lose some body fat but after months of trying it out I feel like I wasn't losing anything even though I was gaining muscle my fat was still there so I wanted to change it up and I am going to follow a better schedule when it comes to my workout routine but also eat a little bit more because I have also been walking a little bit more than I used to I'm gonna show you guys what I eat in a day um just the chick-fil-a biscuit chick-fil-a so we got Chick-fil-A for breakfast and this craving hit. You know what you gotta do. I actually don't mind eating a Chick-fil-A sandwich because there's a lot of protein in it. And you know we all need it for that muscle building. Oh my gosh, look how bad this biscuit is though. It's so thin on the top. One of my favorite ways to eat this chicken sandwich is with a little bit of honey. A little bit, not too much honey. You don't want too much calories. And then I am gonna add some grape jelly. Took a hot minute. There you go, just a little smudge. Cheers. We also ordered some hash browns. I'm not gonna eat this as much because calories. So right now I am drinking coffee and I put a creamer in it. It's called the Kahula creamer. Apparently it's like an alcoholic creamer, but this is not alcoholic. So 15 mils is 35 calories. It was close to 100 calories for the creamer that I put in here. So not too bad. Need a little sweetness when I drink my coffee because I can't drink black coffee yet. So we just ate. Now we're gonna go on a 40 minute walk. 40 an minutes, an hour. That's a lot, but we're gonna do it because it's good for your digestive system after you eat. And I'm trying to get 10,000 steps today. At least 10,000. A little update. I got my Christmas tree up. Wait, let me turn it on the light. There you go. What do you think, guys? This is a blue Christmas tree. It's so pretty. Typically, we do a pink theme, but this year went for blue. I'm on my way down memory lane. Trip I took a break. I just finished day one of the program I just started. A little TMI, but look at my butt. <laughs> this is why you don't wear sweatpants to work out. <laughs> So here, I bought some keto bread. I don't know what it tastes like. My husband said it tastes different. We're gonna try and see. He said there's a different texture to it. Oh, it's like very elastic. Oh, oh, it smells very weedy though. It has, one slice is 35 calories, which is pretty low for uh, bread. It feels so weird, like smooth. Yes, I measure everything out because macros matter now. I'm just gonna focus on eating close to maintenance and see if there's any growth or if I need to go into a surplus. But I'm pretty happy with my weight right now. It's just my arms are a little bit annoying, a little bit flabby to my back. So this is my turkey sandwich, pretty basic. It's just lettuce, turkey meat, and cheese with mayo. And I also got my Chobani yogurt smoothie because this has 10 grams of protein, which I need, especially after that good workout. Let's try this bread though. I'm very interested in how this bread tastes. It's not fluffy. The bread is not fluffy at all. Not bad. It just tastes like bread to me for 35 calories per slice. It could be worth it if you're trying to watch your weight. You know what? I take that back. I thought it was the turkey, but that bread has a really weird aftertaste. It tastes pretty artificial. I don't think I'll buy that again. <laughs> With 35 calories per slice, I'd rather do something at 70 calories and still taste better than the 35 calorie. However, can't go wrong with Chobani smoothie, especially if you're looking for protein. 140 calories and 10 grams of protein. Are you walking in the street? 
so good. My makeup's done. It's time to film skits for the next hour, hour and a half before we go to the store and then pick up our daughter. The skit we're filming right now is gonna be Mom's Favorite Child When Asian Girls Become Pregnant Skit. So if you're not watching my shorts, make sure to watch them. You want a far away shot or a close shot? Close shot. Mom, I was asleep. You just woke me up. He's drunk. Yeah, Mom. Now it's time to film Mama Trans scene. When? Why are you still up? Tom, you're warm early. It's fruit time and someone's gonna help me cut the apple today. Mama. Oh. <laughs> hey, I know you're so excited. Okay. Do you wanna show them your apple, Tessa? <laughs> Good girl. For dinner, my husband is making the smash burgers. Mmm, lots of protein. We got the 80% lean meat, so there's a little bit more fat than if we had gotten the 90% lean meat, but you know, it's okay because we love food and fat makes food delicious. I'm gonna show you guys one of my favorite sauce for burgers. Delicious. Add a little ranch dressing. And you mix it up. All it is is sugar, some mayo, and some ranch sauce. If you guys like sweet sauces. Put the burger, put a little bit of the sauce. Sauce only 35 calories. That's right here. Add in a little bit of ketchup. And that is how you make a delicious smash burger. Now that is some good stuff. Trying to get my husband to work out. He apparently didn't warm up. Now his muscles are all tense. That is why you warm up before a workout. But when he listened uh. to me, but no. <laughs> <laughs> We just got back from the store and I want to show you guys some of my favorite brands when it comes to getting my protein intake in and trying to be healthy. Um, there's this brand called Fairlife. I also got yogurt, smoothies, this is Chobani. I love their mixed berry flavor. The store we went today didn't have it so I picked up their strawberry and banana smoothie and I also got their pina colada popcorn. This is a very good snack if you want something that's high volume but low in calories. Like I would get somewhat full eating a cup of this. I highly recommend this brand and the sweet and salty flavor is delicious. This is flat out protein up from their chickpea powdered protein. This is also an amazing wrap. There's also this Chobani Zero Sugar Yogurt. This is strawberry cheesecake inspired. I didn't buy this today, but I also want to talk to you guys about this brand called Truvia. So I love their zero calorie sweetener. This has been my replacement when it comes to sugar intake. It's been a crazy day. I woke up today around like 6.30 and now it is 10.30. It's definitely bedtime and I am tired AF because it's been nonstop this morning. Working out, walking so much, filming and shopping. Just just trying to vlog everything in one day. It's actually pretty time consuming. I forgot how much vlogging really takes up my time because I was vlogging nonstop in the month of November. I calmed down a little bit towards the end of November, but now I am picking things back up because content is content. I gotta make sure I put up content for you guys. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next vlog.